Good afternoon, I'm Rebecca Bell. First, an extraordinary tale of a kidney transplant patient and her ties to two surgeons at the Royal Food Hospital in Hampstead. The surgeons operated on her 30 years apart. They're also father and son. Carl Mercer has been hearing their campaign to get more people to donate their organs. This is Mr Fernando, the transplant surgeon. And this is Mr Fernando, the transplant surgeon. Really good for the kidney. So hopefully I'll get another 34 years out of this one. 28,000 apprenticeships have been created across London in the last year. This is in the scheme backed by the Mayor. Trainee roles were found at construction firms, accountants and even on the underground. A number of the capital's newest apprentices met with business leaders and the Mayor at City Hall this morning. New bus routes and electric car charging points could be installed across Surrey as part of a new £16 million plan. The aim is to reduce carbon emissions. Epsom, Woking and Redhill could all benefit from the project being considered by the government. Dozens of school children and parents took to the streets of Dulwich this morning to protest at the council's decision to cut lollipop crossings near their schools. And it would seem that their voices have been heard. Southwark Council have announced that it will fund the eight posts that they were due to close for another year. They say schools and the local community will have to find alternative funding after that. Riz Latif will be here at half past six. Thank you for watching. Bye for now.